Hey, Internet. This is Nate. You can also call me Nathan. Please never call me Nathaniel. Welcome back to Vampire Survivors, where the time is right. It's feeling good. Let's go for... We, we basically have done everything. We've, we've played all of the... Uh, um, we've played both maps, cleaned them out. We just haven't beaten the first one on Hyper. And I figure let's let's close it out with a banger and try to get a full set of evolved weapons. Uh, we're going to go uh, Mortacio because Mortacio is the best one because you get extra projectiles. And because we're playing on Hyper, we're going to level up a lot faster. Also, I just realized all my things plugged in. I'm going to just take some damage here. Oh my gosh. Really? We're just going to die. Clean start. Didn't have my headphones plugged in. Good. All right. We set expectations really low. Let's jump back in and do it again. <laughs> All right. Here we go. And of course, my headphones aren't turned up. <laughs> so I can't hear anything anyway. And the music is the best part of this game. So if you're not playing the music, what are you even doing with your life? All right. Easy start. King Bible is the only one of the three that hasn't evolved. Or has an evolution. So uh, not even a tough choice here. Besides the fact that it's one of the best weapons in the game. So we got bones. We're going to get extra projectiles. The only issue with this build is that we can't get the extra projectile ring. Which is disappointing. But fine. Um, knife is also one that we can evolve. So now we need uh, projectile speed for the knife, and we need how long projectiles stay for the Bible. But so far, so good. Oh, here comes the first uh, treasure chest. It comes a lot earlier when you're in hyper mode. Uh, fire wand, so now we need spinach as well. The hardest part is going to just be getting the, the actual combos we need to make this work. Good stuff. Also, we have like a ton of weapons that are unupgraded. Oh, we just get the, uh, the upgrade stone instead. Okay, uh, axe. Also upgradable. We're not going to get any of the items unless we know they match our weapons. We already have a, a good array of weapons here. None of them upgraded. <laughs> it's fine. It's fine. Who needs upgraded weapons anyway? Um, luckily, most of our weapons are pretty... Okay, fantastic. We already get Candelabra. That means we have the axe set, which is fantastic. We need spinach. We need projectile speed. We need projectile uh, time. Here's some food. Ouch. Oh. Oh my gosh. So many bats. The lack of uh, the lack of upgraded weapons is really hurting. <laughs> Nothing just goes fast enough. Uh, okay, let's go extra knife. Again, extra projectiles being the key right now while we're facing these big swarms of bats. Get the axe to hit some of these things. Got him. Good stuff. Here's another quick level up. Is that food down there? It is food down there. Uh, Spellbinder. So now we have King Bible and Axe set. It's all about survival at this point. We got the tools. Oh man, these skeletons might actually be rough. Actually, no. A single, uh, single array of knives just takes them out. Also, the, uh, flame one takes them out. What we're gonna need is a really lucky early treasure chest to get us through. Oh my gosh. There we 
go. Good stuff. Uh, let's go bone. I actually don't want to level up the items if I don't have to. Much better would be to open up or to level up my weapons here. And as soon as we get to level 20, this gets a lot better as well, because we'll get our first extra projectile. But we're not even halfway there yet, so I don't know why I'm even talking about it. There we go. Uh, okay, I would love Duplicator, but it doesn't lead to any evolution, so we don't take it. And I guess in this case, like, we're already going to get three extra projectiles. It's probably fine anyway. Uh, magic Wand also upgrades. So we have our we have our six. They're all ev uh, evolvable weapons. We just got to get really lucky and roll well for the items now. Got them. Speaking of, we really need... Okay, axe. Fantastic. We need to get axe... Oh wait, bone is not evolvable. Crap, we already messed it up. I can't pick the bone. It's not evolvable. Dang, we have to quit. We have to pick somebody else. We have to pick uh, probably uh, Gennario. It's got to be Gennario, Antonio, Arca, or Imelda. Because those are the only four that have an upgradable weapon. Dang. Okay, we'll try it again. I didn't even think about the fact that I had the bones. So we gotta upgrade the knife. Got him. I don't mind knife as a starting item. I don't mind upgrading it early. If we can happen to get projectile speed and get the knife like rolling early, like totally fine. Totally fine. Got him. Okay. Fire one. That's lucky. It's the only one of the three that can be upgraded or evolved in it. So far, so good. Only had a tiny little touch early on. Got him. Also, don't mind the extra early projectile. Will help us because early early game is always the hardest in the forest. I mean, forest in general is hard, but the early game especially is difficult. Let's go then. Oh my gosh. Uh, okay, spinach. Spinach is great. Spinach uh, will help to evolve our fire wand. Projectile speed. Okay, so we have knife. So we, have, we got both the item combo and the item, or equipment, and the item that we need to upgrade uh, both of the equipment we have so far, which is great. So we can get upgraded knife, we can get, or evolved knife, we can get evolved fire wand already. Which is good stuff. If I had a preference, I would probably say King Bible plus Axe. Cross also evolved is not bad, plus you get the luck, which is very useful for chests. And also to get uh, fourth picks. But again, we will only pick items once we have the corresponding equipment. Unless we're forced to pick an item. Okay. Fire wand, level two. The earlier we can level up one of either our fire wand or our knives is the better as well. Ouch. Jerks. Ouch. Gosh, dang it. I feel like they veered off at the last minute. Maybe I didn't. Or maybe I veered off at the last minute. Problem is the knife is not very good when you're running away from enemies. Okay, uh, continue with the fire wand. 
again, we might get axes, but we might not. So I don't want to, uh, I don't want to jinx it here. There we go. One second. Should we do something really quick? There we are. Okay. We're good. Another potential chest and or level up. Hello there, Bobcat. How's it going? Welcome. Continue leveling up the knife. All good stuff. There's no name for the day. That's true. I haven't been doing that for a while. Uh, we might we might start that up in the next stream or so. Today it's just neat. Boring, I know, but sometimes you gotta be boring when life demands it. Okay, we got a chest. Um, I will take an axe. <laughs> no. A lot of names it could be. There's one name it never is. Okay, uh, let's continue leveling up the knife. I would rather have an evolved knife. And what I learned last time, so we will try to use this new tech, is you can hold a chest until after you've already made something level eight. So we just need to stay in the vicinity and not die. My gosh. We do not have a build that deals with uh, mass bats very well. We also are really desperate for food. Thank you, game. There's food. Okay, level five. We're getting there. Good stuff. Okay, so we have three weapons, two of which already have the corresponding equipment or item. Uh, one is still missing the item we need. So we need to get a bigger area. Racers. Oh, nice. That would be great. Yeah, this is definitely a made-for-arcade type of game. Oh, crap. Okay, we're going to have to focus in for a minute. We did just mow through that Banshee real fast, though. These Banshees really can't take this targeted damage too well. Okay, we have two chests now. We can keep saving them as long as we need to. Uh, we don't, oh man, I would love to get that because I hope that we get the King Bible, but until we actually get the King Bible, I can't take it much. There we go. There's some more food. Don't mind if I do. Still looking good. I mean, I probably should take one of the chests. Would be the non-greedy thing to do. But I am a greedy boy, so hard to break old habits. Ah, we'll take one. We'll take the uh, we'll take the this one. Ideally, we get knife or fire wand. Love it. Okay, that's level six knife, I think. Maybe level seven already. Level six. Got him. These banshees are not too scary when you can just like single target them to death. Got him. Okay. Uh, we don't have anything else yet. Let's continue with our fire wand. Also a decent prospect for an early evolved weapon. Knife would be the ultimate though. Like knife is great. I mean axe would be even better, but. Axe is so far off right now. Not really worth going for it before we get the knife. Okay. Kind of having a tough time getting through these banshees, but I believe. I believe in the power of the knives. Ooh, that fire wand did a number on them. Fire Wand is just so 
damaging. It's a few bucks if you're looking to play on the can. I think it's much more expensive. Okay. No new real weapon options here. Oh my gosh. Right now it's 80% off. I have, I kind of have already an idea about the next game I'm going to do. Um, and then I have, an ex I have an idea about the next game after that. <laughs> I'm like three games in the future right now. Uh, because this one, as soon as we're done getting the six for six, I'm, I've pretty much done everything I want to do with it until they do an update. This is definitely one though that when there's updates, we'll come back to because it's super fun. I really like this game a lot. It's that simple but effective like one more time type of game. Oh man, what's the next game? You wanna spoil it? Spoil the surprise? Uh, it's, a, it's a crafting game. I think it's called Potion Crafter. It came out into early access in uh, December, and it's uh, more of an off-stream. I have two off-stream games I'm playing right now. Uh, I'm playing Idol Slayer, which is exactly what it sounds like. It's an idol game. And then, oh crap. No! Gosh dang it. We have to quit. Hi, people. Oh, the game gave us an uh, an impossible an impossible uh, uh, level up. That's so frustrating. None of those uh, lead to evolves, so we can't we can't keep playing. Oh yeah, so I'm playing uh, Idol Slayer on my phone, and I'm playing I think it's like Idol Wizard. I do a lot of uh, phone idol games. I do a lot of idol games in general. Like I did all the way Realm Grinder. Love Realm Grinder. Let's get an axe. Um, I've also done Clicker Heroes to like stupid levels. I'm pretty far into Idol Slayer right now. I'm in the end game right now. Yeah, big fan of uh, big fan of idol games. It's what I do while I uh, watch movies with my wife. Um, I'm okay with the whip. Early whip with an extra projectile is really valuable, especially for like big bat swarms and stuff. King Bible would be the ultimate, hint hint, but uh, whoops, gosh dang it, did not need that. But yeah, so if you're wondering why I restarted, by the way, um, restarting because we're going for uh, only evolved weapons, and I got a shop that was only evolved, or was not evolved weapons, so none of the weapons that were in the shop could evolve. Candelabra, love it. And none of the items led to an evolution. Super annoying. And it was, there was no option to level up any of my stuff that I already had either. It was all new stuff and all new stuff that was garbage. So no garbage shop. No, no garbage levels up. I keep saying shops because of... Uh, um, auto pets, but they are in fact levels up. We have to pick spinach or clover. Um, I'm gonna do spinach. I like the fire one a lot. We have to get it now. Dark mist won't scratch the idol. Okay. It's it's a deck builder, right? Like it's a full-on deck builder. Which I mean, after I mean, I did, I did so many deck builders alongside Monster Train. I'm a little bit deck building out, build, build it out. Um, I, I'm sure that I'll get back to, around to doing some deck builders again, but like for the moment, I'm just not feeling it. Oh my gosh. Roguelike deck builder, yeah. It's very trendy right now, although to be fair, despite the fact, despite the fact that there are so many roguelike deck builders, not all of, not a lot of them are like getting super popular. It's like you have Monster Train, you have Slay the Spire, um, and then you have like the flavor of the month or whatever. So like, 
Grifflands was like popular, but I feel like it kind of. Well, I mean, there's probably there's probably still a community around Grifflands. Might even be a bigger community than what we have for um, Monster Train. Uh, do I have? I don't have cooldown reduction yet. Let's get the knife still. I've seen Rogue Book. I never played it. I, I, it seemed okay. No, but relatively. Monster Train is popular relative to the genre. There's just not a lot of popular games in the genre, to be honest. There's really just Slay the Spire that actually has a thriving community. And even then, we're talking like... What, like four or five streamers? Which is wild to me, because you would think it would, like, naturally lend itself to, like, having big communities, but... I think it's because there's no... There's not really been a good multiplayer roguelite. Or, specifically, roguelite deck builder. That's what I think is needed. Somebody needs to come up, like, Monster Train honestly could have been. But the problem is Hellrush just wasn't flushed out enough. Ring of Pain? I've never done Ring of Pain. Uh, let's continue with the whip. Get our third whip in action. This build actually seems to be going okay so far. And I don't hate upgraded whip. I think upgraded whip is, is pretty, pretty powerful. Uh, let's continue with axes though, if we have a choice. Besides the fact that we already have the axe uh, item that we need, the increased area of effect. We really, the, the thing that worries me is I don't know that we're going to get the fire wand, but we auto pick it. If fire wand is offered, we auto pick because we already have the item and it's too risky to not pick it. Let's get some food. We've been saving that food for a while. Let's make sure we immediately get hit after we use the food. Just to... Uh, demonstrate our lack of fear. We also really need projectile speed for our knife. But like in terms of like strength, this build is not bad. Three weapons, but man, the er, with the whip early does so much work. And I think it's more axes. I think with Slay the Spire, it literally just comes down to the fact that it was, like, the first one. Like, I think any of them, had they come first, would have been the one. But, like, none of them have just been able to dethrone Slay the Spire as, like, the, the one everyone watches. We can kill some of these uh, plants. Knives are usually, like, one of the only ways you can kill plants effectively. We're going to keep this uh, treasure chest for a while. We're just going to try to get through these banshees. Here's some food. We want to keep the chest until we can get either the axe or the knife ready to evolve. Or we get a, or we get another chest. If we get another chest, I'm also fine. Axe seems like the logical choice that we're going to get. How do you deal with waves with knives? Aim and pray. Uh, no, with the support of the whip and the axe. Like, they're... they're right now, the knife is the, like, the kind of hero when in terms of, like, direct damage. But uh, the axe and the, and the whip are really carrying to a large degree right now. Keep going extra knife. That single target damage, being able to like just focus in on these like chunky enemies cannot be undersold how valuable it is. The problem again, we don't have projectile speed, which we're gonna need in order to upgrade the knife or evolve the knife. I keep saying upgrade and evolve interchangeably. They're not the same. We upgrade them all the time. Yeah, knife is really good, especially if you have a roaming style of play. Like, knife's fantastic, because you just, like, clear a path for your guy to walk through. I tend to be very, like, circular in my patterns, which is... Except for in the library. Like, library... But library is just so much easier to play in. Yeah, it's one of the few things you can actually, like, aim, aim. The whip being the other. 
projectile speed. Fantastic. Okay, we gotta take it while we have the chance. The other dangerous... Oh, crap. Ouch. We gotta get... Okay, we gotta get back. We're in a little bit of a dangerous position here. We got stuck between thick bats and fancy hats. Um, there's a lot of units here. Gotta start trying to take care of this uh, the, the great mass that's been forming around us. There's a lot of uh, available experience. Okay, knife, we're almost there. We're at seven. One more knife upgrade, and uh, we're, we're set for a long time. Evolved knife can really just work for a long time. Okay, we're going to work our way back. Let's try to dig our way through the mass. We have... Okay, we have signs of big bats. We really got to get our knife up. Fire wand. Love it. Yes. Okay, so now we're good. We've got three for... Th Three out of four of our weapons are ready to upgrade. We're ready to evolve in terms of, like, equipment. We just need to get the levels there for the knife and for the axe. Okay, we gotta be close. Come on. Level, 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 please. Oh my gosh. We somehow survived. We're like Palpatine. We just somehow survived. Um, okay, axe... But really, knife, whenever you're ready. It's target damage. Okay, there we go. Oh, that was good. We got, we got a good shot with that axe there. Axe is doing a lot of work right now for us. Getting us back. Okay, knife or axe. One of the two. Come on. Knife, love it. Okay. Evolve knife. Here we go. Now things change. What? How did we not get Evolved Knife? We got projectile speed. Scumbag chest. I mean, I'm not going to complain about getting better axes, but I'm going to complain about not getting a better knife. Luckily, this is the one build that uh, we can kind of burn through these bats pretty easily. Okay, here's another chest. We just got to get to the chest now. Get, get to the chest. Burn them through the bats. Yeah, that was really weird. Normally, you just get it. Okay, here we go. Now we should get the knife. Whip! What? What is happening? We got projectile speed. Why aren't we getting the evolved knives? Was there a patch I'm not aware of that that ruined my life? Okay, we need food. Has to be 10. Oh, after 10 minutes? Oh, hey, look, food. Okay, we gotta get out. Ouch. Let's make our path over here. And we're gonna dig our way out. Get him. Get him. Get out. There we go. Okay, now we can face the form, the throngs. I am on Instagram, kind of. Um, I, I have a personal Instagram. I don't do uh, Instagram. I have a Twitter. I have the YouTube. I don't have a Never Nathaniel Facebook or Instagram account. So I just use Instagram for family right now. I know, with my looks, you, it's surprising I don't have a, uh, a personal Instagram account just for modeling, but just where do you get the time, guys? All right, here we go. Knife. There we go. fan for fantastic Burn through as many of these plants as possible just to get some extra experience here. Okay, skeletons time. These guys are a piece of cake now. Yeah, 
right, now, now we're solid. Use the most room, get experience points. Okay. That was a close shot. Burn, burn, burn. Did I see food over there? I can't, I can't see anything right now. Okay, we can continue to level. Let's go spinach. So we need hollow heart. And then we need two more weapons that are evolvable. <sighs> Scary. We're getting some really unlucky uh, level ups here. Cross, you can level up. We just need to get spinach, or not spinach, we need to get uh, gar- or... Okay, axe, axe is ready to go. We need to get uh, cross wand and holy bible. Or uh, bible, those are, the, those are the three. Hollow heart, love it. Okay, we're four for five. We just need, we just need the uh, clover. Which has shown up like a billion times in the shop, but do we have a level eight? Let's go with uh, whip. Do we have level eight axe? We do. Okay, so when we if we get a chest here, we can level up and we can get it. But imagine if we have. Um, we're almost there. Werewolves are just gonna get mowed down as well. Um, continue with whip. I get nervous, guys. We need to get one more weapon, or one more uh, equipment, weapon, and then two more items. Let's burn our way back through. Food, love it. Who doesn't like a good floor chicken? Uh, keep with the fire wand. So Axe is ready to go. Um, Fire Wand's getting close. Holy crap. Holy crap. Let's uh, give ourselves some breathing room here. And then just dive back in. Oh no, don't die, don't die, don't die. We gotta keep moving, we gotta keep moving. Almost lost it there, guys. I made a uh, very risky venture. And it did not... It's not good for our health. We really need... Uh, let's continue with Fire Wand. We really, really, really need food. Thank you. We also really, really, really need... A chest. Clover! Yeah, that wave was just freaking huge. And I, I ran right back into it. Like, that was stupid. There was no reason for me to do that. I just got cocky, I guess. Um, I'd like to turn around at some point, though. Okay, we got bats. Big bats is a good sign. It means we're out of the werewolf era of things. And big bats are not scary, because they just don't come in such large waves. That also means that we're going to get some... Um, we're going to get some uh, chests with bosses soon. Or bosses with chests. really just need the chest for um, the axes, and then we're in really great shape. We can mow down things from afar. But this is one problem with the knives, is that they just don't... Okay, here we go. Gotta kill this guy, get his chest. Clover, love it. Okay. Okay, we'll get the axe, plus a bunch of other goodies. Excellent. Super axes, extra clovers, extra whip, and just don't die. Don't die. Love it. Oh my gosh. Scary times. Axes, carry me. Oh my gosh. Werewolf. Get wrecked, werewolf. Oh no, oh no, oh no. Don't die, don't die, don't die. Holy crap.
Don't die. Don't die. No! Oh, boo! Boo! Dang it, we almost had it. Knives just not good enough. Um, I'll try it again. I still think we gotta go with him. We gotta have the extra projectile. Man, this is rough. Axes wasn't even enough. They just couldn't carve through everything as quickly. Um, I think out of these, Magic Wand has the benefit that then we can get cooldown reduction, which is good for like basically everything else. So we're gonna go with it for now. Bible, love it. Okay, so we want Bible. Love it. We got some targeted damage with our magic wand. We got some aimable damage. Blindfold challenge. <laughs> yeah, I don't blindfold games, guys. It's not my thing. I would consider speed running this game, but um, how do you speed? <laughs> Fastest to 30 minutes. <laughs> Wind streaking could be interesting, trying to wind streak the game. Uh, we need for bracers for the knife. Oh, whoops. I could have just saved the food, but it's fine. Okay, so we got four weapons, all of which are upgradable. We have one corresponding item. We'll take a uh, clover there. And empty tome. Fantastic. Okay, we're two for four. That would be that would be kind of cool. Maybe somebody will do it. Uh, it won't be me. <laughs> but so far, our early level ups have been pretty good. We're not terribly strong right now because we haven't been leveling up. We're trying to acquire the equipment. Ow. Um, I, I mean, I'm going to keep going. Oh, wait. No, we want Spellbinder. That way we can guarantee uh, Bible. As good as Axe is, getting guaranteed Evolve combos is more important right now. More knives. Man, the game is like set on making sure that we evolve knives for anything else. Okay, just kind of trying to maneuver them into my Bibles here. Um, more magic wand is also fine. I mean, leveling up magic wand is not. It's not amazing, but it, I mean, at at max rank, it's actually okay. All right. Keep cruising. We've got two local uh, foods nearby. Also, we have a kill all. We should save the kill all for later. Let's grab an axe now. Cooldown reduction is going to be fantastic for the axe. So we're going to save the kill all for like a get out of jail moment when we're going to need one. And you can use it on the plants, which is kind of hilarious. Once the uh, plants start closing in. Yeah, exactly. Okay, there's a chest. It's too early. We'll get a chest now. Please don't get an item. Fantastic. Knives. Alright, I guess we're going to try to go for level 8 knives again first. I think knives was level 3. Yeah. There's fire wand. That could be our six. So we got all the equipment. Now we just need the corresponding items. So we need spinach. We need clover. We need spinach. So we're four for six. 
In terms of setup, we're doing great. We got a we got a cross ready to go. We've got food just abound all around us. Like you couldn't ask for a better setup from like a setup perspective. The problem right now is his damage scaling is not there. Okay, Candelabra, we're five for six. We literally only need um what projectile? No, we have projectile speed. We have cooldown reduction. Uh, we have spellbinder. Oh, we need clover. Clover and we're there. And then we can just focus on leveling up equipment. And this is like a great setup too. If we can get this to work, like... Here's our gangbusters. Okay, gotta level up the knife there. Good stuff, good stuff. No! Crap, I got too close. I flew too close to the sun. Filled with regret. Uh, magic wand. Sorry, duplicator. I love you, but not today. Okay, we have three. We have four foods in the area. We have one over here too. So we're just rolling in food, which I will never complain about. Okay, keep going. Knife. Knife's at level five. We can try to kill some plants here. If we want. Although I'm just realizing the knives are not dropping uh The knives are not or not sorry, no not knives. The plants aren't dropping experience. Okay, we're five minutes. And honestly, I feel like we're looking really solid. We've got like the best weapons I think you could get. I would maybe take Whip over Magic Wand, but like, Hollow Heart's not that great, so probably the cooldown reduction is just better anyway. Axe. Okay. Axe is level 3? No, level 2. Oh wow, we're still early days with the Axe. Really want King Bible upgraded. That would be like... That would be the E chain. Oh, we have another uh, we have another infinite kill here. Continue with the knives. Really gotta get looking for clovers, guys. Clovers, and it's done. We just gotta then survive. The uh, tactical pieces or the strategic parts over, and then it's just you gotta survive. We're good for the moment. We're gonna try to keep things kind of localized to the area. Also, just keep ourselves close-ish to our food and our detonation for when we need it. I think we try to save this cross. Oh my gosh, another food. Let's at least eat one of them, get full health, why not? Um, we'll save this crucifix for uh, the, second, the second big wave if we can. Oh, there's another crucifix. Love it. So if we can save them, one for an emergency if we need it, and then the other one. We have so much food, like three food, two crucifixes. Like, game is just giving everything to us. Okay, there we go with knife level seven. Now we'll know we're getting ready for the uh, the big plunge when um, we get the white bat. Gonna try to beat this uh, center of the mass here. Oh my gosh. They got really lucky there. The Red Sea just kind of parted around us. There we go. Burn through there. Don't take a crucifix. Okay, let's go axe. There's another treasure chest. Um, I think we can get it now because we're gonna get one at 10 minutes when the uh, when the wall appears again. Okay, cross. It's fine. We really just need um, axes and or knives again. King Bible would have been the best, but I think it's still like level one. Yeah, level one King Bible. Okay, we got knives. 
We just gotta wait, I guess, till 10 minutes, apparently. This is the uh, new thing we learned. And then we're gonna we're gonna do a uh, full annihilation of the plants, plus the boss, plus the big bats. Once uh, that phase has started. In the meantime, we're just we're just cruising, and then we can save the other one for any other emergency moment. Got it. Again. Not trying to get the crucifix, but just trying to get the experience around it. We already have knife there. Second one. Okay, Bible. More Bibles, love it. Forge on some EXP here. It's the one nice thing about the library is that like all the XPs tend to be pretty concentrated anyway. Okay, there's the white one. We gotta wait till after 10 minutes to uh, do the chest, but we can prep. Okay, we got to get around. Got it. Got to get around so we can have a free shot on the crucifix. Okay, we're going to work our way around again. There's a crucifix up top. Just waiting for the moment. Got to keep a healthy healthy path open when the time comes. Okay, there's some food down here. Let's just grab this while we're thinking about it. Because we still have plenty of food up top. Man, the walls are just not closing in. We need the walls to close in, guys. Alright, here we go. Crucifix. Work our way around. Crucifix. Got it. Boom! Love it. There we go. Knife upgrade. Or an axe, I guess. Is that level seven axe, I believe? Four, we're not even close. I always am off on when stuff is happening. Um, okay. Still just need, still just need our one little, oh, actually they did get, the plants did give us the XP. I was totally wrong. I was wrong about being wrong. I should have believed in myself. Okay. We're about to get werewolves soon. After, I think, skeletons first. This should be the knives. There we go. Okay, we got knives. We're kind of back to where we were before. The only difference now is we have King Bible, which is certainly better. Okay, we gotta stay near food. Keep leveling up King Bible. If that could be our second one, then we would be really okay. Also, apparently we have even more food than we ever imagined possible. Here's a quick, uh... Yep, Bible definitely over with, for sure. Bible. So we're just waiting. We're in the uh, in the clover waiting room right now, and just praying that we don't get a crap store. The nice thing is, is that we can't get any bad weapons because we're already full of weapons. Oh my gosh! Just get in there with these skeletons. There we go. Okay, King Bible man, it's a coming. Level five already. Just a second ago, it was level two, so getting some good upgrades here. We don't need hollow, hollow heart. Again, we auto pick clover, even if it means delaying our king bible, because uh, that will guarantee us the six of all. Okay, axe getting ever closer. This is looking good, guys. This is looking really good. I am what you would call a fan of 
how this is looking. The fact that we keep getting the Bible as well is just absolutely amazing. Okay, magic wand. I mean, just being able to like keep things at a distance is so valuable. burn through a bunch of guys now. I want to burn through this bat. There we go. Uh, I'm going to hold off on this one until we get a level 8 something. Uh, what's the closest? King Bible and Axe are tied at 6. So we're going to play uh, Protect the Chest for a little while. There's Axe. Not getting any uh, clovers though, which is making me very nervous. I mean, as long as we keep getting other stuff, it's fine, but eventually we gotta get that clover. Okay, okay, okay. There we are. Gotta just kind of thread the needle there. Danger zone now. This is where we got to keep on the move. Okay, King Bible, level 7. Love it. Keep giving me those King Bibles. You will not see me complaining about having King Bible be the next thing that we upgrade here. It attack and it protect. But mostly it attack. <laughs> it's safe from heck. That's what it should be. The Bible. It attack, it protect, but mostly it's safe from heck. Clover! Oh, we got it. All we have to do is survive and we get six evolved weapons. Here we go. Here we go. Okay. Danger zone. If we can survive long enough to level up either the King Bible or the Axe. King Bible or the Axe. We're about to hit 15 minutes, which is the scary, scary times. Okay, King Bible. Burn through, burn through them. Burn through the pain. We're so close. Okay, we're gonna get some distance and we're gonna loop. I think we got two chests at this point that we can choose from. But we gotta we gotta get through before uh Why? Why? All I have to ask is why. Okay, gotta get through, gotta get through. We're gonna stay near this upper chest here. Okay, there's the boss. We're in danger. We gotta clear a path. And survive. Just survive, Nate. Just survive. Here we go. We're working our way around. There's another chest down here. This is a two-chest operation. Axe, love it. Grab it. Okay, now we just need to level up on the King Bible, and uh, we can survive. We still have a tiny bit of health. I think we even have, do we still have any of our food around that we had for a long time? Okay, Bible. Between, okay, there we go, food, food. Oh my gosh, level up. Bible, not yet, uh, cross. Magic wand. That's fine. Any other evolved weapon, I will take at this point. There's more food. Mantises, we gotta get through you. Okay, we gotta get back to our chest. Okay, 
Okay, we have another chest. We have, we have several chests. We just need... We'll start at the, the top and work our way down. We just need... Uh, one more level up, potentially, to get us there. Okay, we have another one. We just gotta get to a chest. Chest! Got it. There's another chest down here, too. Okay, so now we get the super magic wand. Also, I mean, anything is gonna help us right now. King Bible would be the ultimate, but anything will will keep us around. Anything that doesn't have any... There we go. Okay. There we are. Get some food. Burn through. Fire wand. Meteor is also great. I will take a meteor. This is like the calm. A little bit of calm right now. That's all we need. We will take advantage of this break by breathing, doing some Lamaze breathing, and uh, centering ourselves in preparation for the next big plunge. But so far, this is good. I think soon we're going to get uh, ultimate flowers. Okay, let's see if we can level up. Quick level up, never hurt anybody. Oh, I love it. Cross. It's time. Boom. Big Bible. Big Bible in the house. Okay, let's go center ourselves closer to the other chest. And we are there. We've, we've reached Nirvana. Who knew? To reach Nirvana, you needed a Bible, some knives, and an axe. That's all you needed. Everyone makes it so complicated, but you just need those three things. Although a magic wand is also helping. Okay. Making progress. Another level up soon would be uh, frowned upon. Do they actually move faster or do they just spin in place faster? Okay, we still got two chests ready and willing. We just need the candidates. Okay, cross is the closest. We'll go with that. I love upgraded cross too, by the way. Super fun. The swords that slashed a thousand throats. Man, we got experience everywhere. Grab a food, pop ourselves off. Oh, they spin faster giving the DPS. Ah, I see. Cool. Uh, can you with the cross? Goodbye, bats. Okay, we are getting we're getting love tapped here. <gasps> Whoops. <coughs> well, awkward. Um, 
<coughs> what would be better? Is Antonio better? <coughs> because of the strength? Or is the extra projectile better? Arca is also cooldown reduction. We could go with Arca for the cooldown reduction. Because almost all... I mean, there's a couple of things that don't. Um, let's get Magic Wand, because then we can stack cooldown reduction and we have a targetable thing. I will miss the extra projectile, but I think we'll survive. So then we're going to want Whip, Axes... Obviously, Bible, if we can get it. Cross. Cross is also fine. Cooldown reduction is great for the crosses as well. So we got three, we got three uh, evolvable weapons. No items yet. Man, that last run was so perfect. And I botched it. I wasn't watching where the boss was. I am going to assume we're going to get axes, so I'm just going to predict that and grab the uh, area of effect now. Well, King Bible also doesn't benefit from CDR, and neither does the Magic Wand, but it's fine. The rest will, and they benefit greatly. The axes especially. Axes and the uh, Meteors love that. Um, we'll continue to level up the fire wand. Yeah, Bible is just too good. You're exactly right. I wish... They need to make an evolve for the bones, because the bone is so fun. Watching that thing just, like, bounce the crap out of guys is hilarious. It's a good time. Stick with this for now. The other nice thing about the whip is that it heals you. It's not a lot, but it's just enough that it's worth it, I think. Especially when you have those giant hordes where they're stacking. Okay, there we go. Um, so it would be whip, king bible, and axes would be our last three. We don't get the knives. The thing is, the knives are so good at single target damage, but yeah, they're not really good outside of that. I love a clover. Okay. We're just going to keep leveling up and not get any pairs. I guess it's fine. We don't actually need a pair until uh, 10 minutes in. Finish we need. Okay, so now we have Fire Wand upgrade ability. Which I don't mind. Like, Fire Wand's amazing to upgrade. Those Meteors do so much work. I'm gonna keep trying to get through this uh, dude. Just experience. Empty tome. Now we've got three pairs. No, we don't. We have two pairs and two singles. This should get us a level up. We'll stick with cross for now, but it's hard not taking an evolvable weapon when we have the chance. But we gotta get axes. We gotta get King Bible if we can. Um, I also love Evolved Crosses. They're fantastic. So do we take Spellbinder, assuming we're going to get it? 
I think I like the idea of trying to get at least one evolved weapon as early as possible. Although, I, I, it's tough not to take it right away, because we're going to hopefully get King Bible. Um, but honestly, at a certain point, we'll just take what we can get. Rune Tracer is another one that I would love to have an evolved thing. Yeah, Skeleton is just really good because you get all of the... Uh... Okay, now we have to take Spellbinder. So now we have to get King Bible. Um... Yeah, Laurel's great. I was thinking it was going to be complete trash. Laurel's actually really, really good. I was surprised at how effective I found it. But the skeleton in general is just really solid. Because the extra projectiles are so valuable. And especially if you're playing on Hyper, where you just get so much more experience. Okay, we have the best fire wand in the business. Unfortunately, we can't tell it where to go. We can't get these crosses out, though. Crosses doing a lot of work. The problem is, is these stupid... These dang plants keep uh, distracting our fire wand from doing actual work. It's also been a while since we got a decent chest. Okay, extra crosses is fine. We still need the uh, spinach for the crosses. Or not spinach, we need the clovers for the crosses. We have spinach already. So we need to get King Bible, we need to get Clover, and then we just need one more pair. Oh, and Axe. We need Axe, Axe, King Bible, Clover, and then either Whip and Hollow Heart, or uh, Knives and Projectile Speed. Knives and Bracer. Okay, Fire Wand's almost there. And again, I love Meteor. Meteor is fantastic. I don't know what it's actually called, but the Meteor, the Meteors that come out are really, really good. They do so much damage, and they just clear paths for you. Just keep it going. Okay. I mean, these high damage fireballs are just crushing these guys. The problem is, is that we just can't aim them very well. They typically hit something. I've never tried a full run with uh, Pentagram, but I could see with Arca and cooldown reduction and full cooldown reduction from your upgrades, like that could be pretty sick. Okay, level up. Uh, let's go across. Oh my gosh. Cross is another one I actually like quite a lot, though. Because you get, like, a huge area of effect on the backswing. Ouch. Which I find very, very effective. You can get a good backswing. Oh my gosh. We're gonna need to go get food. The lack of uh, knives is throwing me off. So we have to make our pick. I... I guess we'll go whip. For the healing and because then we get hollow heart, which gives us more health, making us less likely to get one shot. That's probably fine. And it benefits from cooldown reduction. Not as good of a build as we had last time so far. We need King Bible still, we need axes still. And it's not even a choice, we can't even take knives. Because uh 
we didn't take, um, or because we already have the items that we need. We've got four singles right now. Ow. Let's just grab this. All right, so ideal would be fire wands just so that we have the level 10. Okay, that's fine. Those are the only two that so far have the pairing is the fire wand and the magic wand. So I'm okay with those two continuing to get leveled up. So we need hollow heart, clover, axe, and bible. Oh my gosh, see that backswing on those? Okay, so now we're at, we're at max. But did you see the backswing on those uh, crosses? That was sick. Okay, hold on, let's get a quick level up here. We have another one coming up. Fantastic, hollow heart. Okay, we got three pairs, two singles, or three singles. Three pairs, three singles. Ouch. Food, thanks. Appreciate ya. Oh my gosh. I mean, the fire wand, it burns through, but we really need, really need the upgrade so that it can pierce. The piercing on the fire wand is so good. So we're gonna wait for a minute, but I'm gonna stay in the area. Okay, we get food as well. Not bad. Good. We really try to. I'd love to get like a good backswing into the middle of the group from the crosses, but tough to try to force. Okay, so we're gonna be able to upgrade our fire wand from one of these two bosses if we can survive the. Oh, ouch. Survive! Nope. <laughs> oh my gosh. Gah. Just super hard when we don't have any of like the the reliable targeting damage. I wonder with knives if we would have been okay. Hard to say. Okay. This is probably gonna be my last go. See if we can do it. Here's a last chance. Got a nice. Why are you shooting up there? There's nothing up there. Heaven forbid you shoot the giant swarm literally next to you. There we go. Okay. Uh, I gotta take knife. It's the only one that works. I don't mind knife. We can we can go without the whip, and that's okay. But they really need to make... Uh, I think that's probably next on there. They said there's a content patch coming up relatively soon. I would hope that that's one of the first things we're going to do is add more evolvable weapons. Rune Tracer and Bones would be my priority picks, but I could see also... Like, either of the pigeons could be cool. I don't really use the pigeons that much. But, like, if they could find a way to make him interesting after being evolved, that would be kind of sick. Okay, let's go with Axe. Okay. Still a regular chest. Okay. Knives is not a bad first upgrade, but we're going to need something very, very soon after it. Okay, Knives. We need projectile speed, we need size, we need our area, we need uh, cooldown reduction, and we need spinach. Okay, fire wand. Would be interesting to see if you could do like a pentagram focused run with cooldown reduction, 
Yeah, that's the only issue is the cooldown is like so freaking long. The only problem, actually no, pentagram you can't do because it doesn't actually, this is the thing that irritates me so much about it, it doesn't leave behind experience points, it just clears everything, which is super lame. I guess they thought it was too overpowered if they actually gave you stuff, which I think is ridiculous. It leaves behind if you level it. Ah, okay. I was not aware. I've never been able to level it before. It scales on luck. There's a freeze. We can save that for an opportune moment. These bats are not worth it. We'll get the lucky charm. Though. Candelabra. Fantastic. So we have a pairing. First pairing. Of course, the axe is not even close to being leveled up, but, you know, we'll take a pairing at least. Ouch. It's still 38 seconds with max CDR. Yeah, that's not worth it. Uh, more axe. Not really when I wanted to use the freeze, but I'll take it, I guess. Okay, fire wand. We also got level 10, which is why our things are going a little bit faster. Although we do need Bracer. Let's take a Bracer. I hate not leveling up the axes, but we need the Bracer. And uh, it's much more important to fill out our equipment and items right now than to just purely level up. No King Bibles for a while, though. The game's going to withhold them from me until the very end. Uh, let's go axes. Early Axes is also really good um, of evolution. Okay. Making progress. And that last run, though, we totally had it. Uh, I'm just going to go Fire Wand. I don't know if we're gonna I don't think we'll take the whip if we don't have to. I'd much rather have the crosses and the um, holy or the, the the King Bible. Okay. Got this jerk. Should be pretty easy, okay. Area since it's the only one we can pick. There's a treasure chest. We'd love to get a good one, but we won't yet. Axe though, that's good. That's level seven axe? No, level six. Level five! Holy crap, I'm way behind mentally from where I thought we were. We can go clean up some experience here. Okay. Someone was mentioning there's like a third level, but I think that's a lie. Is that true, or is there actually a third level that I haven't played yet that you have to get through some secret way? Someone was saying, like, if you kill a secret boss, there's a third level, a third map. But I haven't seen anything like that either. I think I even looked at the uh, both the subreddit and... 
How do you kill death? You'd have to like have invulnerability. You have to have invulnerability, and you have to be able to stop time, and you have to get a crucifix. And even then, it still might not be enough. Yeah, I, I. Does crucifix do infinite damage, or does it have like a fixed number? Maybe it's something that they were planning to implement that wasn't ready yet. But instead of like changing it so that it was uh, not possible at all, they just added a bunch of damage to him. So the cheaters could actually still get him a new character in. Oh crap. Got through. Uh, keep going with the axe. up and grab all the CXP now. I feel like there might have been, oh my gosh, food. Lots of food. Holy cow. Let's grab one. We'll kind of hang around the others. King Bible. Man, freaking fantastic. Okay. We're good. An extra death spawns every minute. Oh my gosh. Just in case you already weren't dying. I wonder what the longest somebody's been able to survive without cheating. We're getting there, we're getting there. 34 minutes, that's wild. I mean, unfortunately, the evolved weapons are just not good enough because they don't have any stasis, you don't have any vulnerability. Like, it's just too hard. What's typically the most, I guess, single target DPS, I think it would be the knives, right? So in terms of like what you'd want to use to damage, I would think that your number one choice would be ouch, the knives. But I honestly don't even know. Okay, we're about to reach critical mass here. We've got almost level eight axes and almost level eight Oh, Fire Wand would be the, the next one. The problem is we don't have spinach yet. So even if we get the Fire Wand up, we don't have enough... Uh, we haven't upgraded it enough. I'd really like to be able to kill you guys. It would be really great. That'd be so cool. This is a non-damage build. Oh, this is dangerous. Okay, we gotta get out. I think this is going to be a get out via plants scenario. Okay, we're gonna make a loop. We could get out. We just don't have enough damage right now. We're close, but it's not quite there. Okay, we got the level 8. Unfortunately, we're missing the uh, spinach. And we just have not leveled up the right things, I guess. Okay, so freezing time would be fantastic right now. Let's try to clear our way through here. Food. 
And our King Bible is not leveled up enough. Our knives are not leveled up enough. We have fireballs, but we don't have fireballs leveled up to where... But we don't have spinach yet is the problem. And so the fireballs only hit like three enemies and then die. So in swarm situations, not doing a lot of work for us. We really just need to find a uh, crucifix somewhere, but... Did he just teleport over there? Oh my gosh. Do we need food? Desperation. Desperation. No more skeletons, please. Oh my god. Ah. How is this guy not dead? We've hit him with so many axes. Oh no, we got werewolves. Uh, more King Bibles, please. And some food. Danger. Danger. A lot of things on the screen right now. There we go. Let's kill this guy. Before he ruins our lives and eats all of our steak. Thank you. Okay, we need... Uh, we need a level 8 axe. Or we need to get spinach. Then we can open the chest and get an evolved weapon. But until then, we are sitting ducks. Okay, we're gonna keep kind of working our way around here. It's gonna it's about to get it's about to get real ugly real fast. Oh no, oh no. Oh no. Bibles, save me. Axe, okay. Axe body spray, coming in to save the day. Okay. Now we just gotta survive long enough to get spinach. And then it's getting better. Also, Bible, leveling up is not bad. Knives would be good. We just don't have like any items here. Yes. Clear path. Clear path axes. Okay, we're gonna come around this way. Good stuff. No! Alright, we're gonna end. Too tough. Because you have to get like... like I could, On the library, this would be easy. It's just hard on the forest, but that's where we want to do it. Let's power up at least. Uh, we can get better luck. Cooldown reduction might not be bad though. You know what I'm gonna do? I'm gonna refund. Oh, let's grab you. Let's max you out. Let's max you out. I don't think we need greed anymore. I think greed had its purpose, but now it's like not as useful. Um, did you just go might? For 25% extra damage. I don't know if armor is good. Minus 3 damage per hit. Growth could be interesting. Don't know. Duration only has certain things that it affects. Uh, area Augment area is pretty good. Let's just do might then. And then a little bit of HP. All right, so we're going to end for now. We'll come back one last time and try to get these six. Uh, but for now, this has been Nate. You can also call me Nathan. Please never call me Nathaniel. And I will see you guys.